Hey, what's up, y'all? And welcome to the first installment vlog of our grand road trip uh, with me and my little brother, John. We just landed in Las Vegas and picked up the car. They were actually, they were overbooked and they were completely out of cars, which is crazy. There was a lot of pissed off people, but somehow they were able to find us one, not one we booked, a more expensive one. Uh, so we got lucky there. John went to go find a bathroom here at the airport. We're parked in the airport parking after picking up the car. And I think we're going to take a two to three hour nap here in the car. And then uh, we'll have to start heading towards Zion National Park because we do have reservations there. We woke up around 5.45 and headed towards Salt Lake City because that is the, the highway that we need to take in order to get to Zion National Park. And we actually, there's John right here, mom and dad. Uh, we actually just crossed the border into Arizona. The landscape here is pretty sweet. There we go. Yeah, the landscape is pretty awesome. So we will update you once we get closer to Zion National Park. We're trying to get there by 10 a.m. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. John and I have actually finally made it to Zion National Park. We have a reservation with the shuttle bus from hours 10 to 11. It's 9.38 right now, so in about 20 minutes, we can get in line and start heading towards the uh, park. And I think our main thing right now is we're gonna try to see Angel's Landing. It's probably gonna be the most crowded. I don't know, I heard it's kind of dangerous looking, so maybe that'll scare some people off, but I'm gonna change uh, and then I get my camera ready to go to Zion National Park. We are making great strides here at the top. Just kidding, we're at the bottom of Angel's Landing. We still have a long way to go. But, it's got that view though. The autofocus. Wow. the GoPro for some action shots. It is snowing, so we're gonna have to get down, but the view was worth it, I would say. No, I'm just gonna take a couple more pictures before we die up here. Okay, so update. Um, we got back from Zion to our car and we're on our way to the Airbnb, but we kind of ran into a snowstorm. Yeah, our car could not make it. We made it luckily very close to the Airbnb, went into a day's in, 
it wasn't even a Days Inn. It was it was its own brand of inn. It, it was it's not a chain. And the innkeeper, her name is Shauna. She um, let us put our luggage in her car and drove us to the Airbnb. So we got to the Airbnb, but unfortunately, the power is out. So yeah, we're gonna have to try to build a fire and um, use these candles and kind of make it throughout the night. We bought a couple of snacks. So just for the sake of keeping this video short, we're gonna wrap it up here. Hey, what's up y'all? So, looks like we are still alive, but I don't know if you can see that. Definitely can't, I'll go outside a little bit. It is still snowing and it's gonna continue snowing until midnight, I think. So we're snowed in for today. There's John working on the fire. We don't have much wood left, so we might have to go outside and get some more. But for now, we've got a nice working fire. As you can see, it is a wonderland out here. Luckily, these boots, these very expensive Solomon shoes have been coming in handy. I'm going to definitely keep my end of the bargain, as I said. I don't know if you can hear me. We'll be taking some portraits or some pictures from my Instagram here. I don't know why. Just because, you know, it's a missed opportunity. So as you can, I mean, I don't want to miss that opportunity. As you can see here, I've got my handy dandy tripod and laptop or handy dandy tri tripod and camera canon eos r and a sweet cabin behind me so gotta make the best of this anyway so definitely want a really cool like wide shot picture of me doing a beer still making it look like you know we can have fun out here in this kind of weather look how thick the snow is god thank god for these shoes man solomon Solomon shoes, they're amazing, they're wonderful. What we're gonna do is kind of aim from this angle right here, me on the corner, should be awesome. So let me get the camera set up real quick. All right, tripod is set up and looking directly up here. Also, I've got it set to where I've got an automatic timer. So let's see if, we, let's see if this works. So I'm just gonna be calling the shots from up there. Here's my land shark. Use my automatic timer, see if you can see the button right here. Boom. Looks like the camera's gonna work. Looks like this is working. I'm gonna take this off, take a couple of shots. Also, I have to take this off because then otherwise, how am I supposed to drink the beer? Um, but then uh, I'll show you how the shots look right here. to come down again and finally it is getting a little bit dark and so my little brother who is currently inside getting ready he's about to come help me out he's gonna help me shoot a couple of slow motion cinematics so I'm gonna play those right now as well So, brought it back inside the house, and thanks to Shauna, we do have some groceries. Have some fruit, some soup, some meat, some eggs, and my essential mac and cheese. We gotta put some food together, watch a movie, and I do have one idea left for one more picture. If John is willing to help me out, I think it'll be really cool. But never tried it before, so. We'll see how it goes. Oh yeah, I think this will be the perfect movie to watch right now. Get all these liquids. Can I see one of those for silence? Yeah, All right guys, for, for the end of the episode here, John's gonna be taking some pictures here 
um, and we've got this red LED light set up so that's gonna look kind of cool and then we're gonna have it up against the backdrop and see if we can get like a red blue kind of uh, color scheme but um, this yeah we'll show the pictures right after this and now John and I are gonna try to see if we can make it out of this mountain because we got to keep our plans going so thanks for watching until next time Peace.